Hey, good to see you here in the 8 News Now newsroom and LasVegasNow.com. I hope you're having as much fun where you are as we are in the newsroom today. We're celebrating our Halloween, and there's all kinds of crazy people running around here with their uh, with their costumes on and stuff. Uh, we are getting serious about the news, though. We have a lot coming up for you at 4 and 4.35 and 6, not the least of which is uh, Operation Trick or Treat. Local authorities trying to round up all kinds of, especially sex offenders, who might be a threat to children uh, during Halloween time. Uh, they arrested 51 fugitives, and 31 of them, uh, we're sex offenders, so we're cracking down on that. We'll also tell you about how the uh, Halloween holiday is really being good for our economy. The stores are just packed for Halloween goodies. And we'll also tell you how Sears is not waiting for the day after Thanksgiving or Black Friday to start its holiday sales. They're actually kicking that in uh, right now, so just an indication of how the retail season is going to go for the rest of the year. Also want to remind you about free rides home. If you've had a little bit too much to drink, want to encourage you not to drive. We'll tell you about the tipsy toe and how you can take advantage of that. Uh, today is Nevada Day. You may be experiencing some places being closed down. Uh, we'll uh, tell you about the celebrations on this day for Nevada Day, the Battleborn State. And we'll also bring you pictures of a couple of guys who rigged up an iPhone Halloween costume that's really pretty impressive, pretty expensive. We'll bring that to you and a lot more, like I said, on our news at 4 and 4.35 and 6. We'll see you then.